So I'm going to talk to you today about a couple of different aspects of the security organization and how we evaluate the efficacy and whether or not you're actually getting a good return on your investment. So this talks about your dollars. Your dollars are better spent not having them do reconnaissance, but having them do analysis. The set of resources required for security programs gets larger and larger over time. You identify security vulnerabilities and then you start to see them drop off. The more time you spend on it, the fewer that you find and eventually you reach kind of like a trailing tail here where you are spending more time in identifying fewer vulnerabilities. Threat modeling is a methodology that um, I created when I went to Microsoft to help folks answer the question, you know, is my application secure? Am I doing enough? Am I doing the right things? How do I know what I'm supposed to be doing when, when it comes to trying to secure this application? Over time, you get a process that is so complicated that it, it starts to feel undoable. So you're also infuriating the engineering organization. They start to think of the security organization as an impediment to their work, and that's not what we want. A lightweight process is probably more appropriate. Maybe this is the sort of thing that you spend a few hours on for each component, like for each major component, a couple of hours. So threat modeling is worthwhile, but make sure it's appropriate to your organization. Is my time or money well spent? Does the program match the need? Make sure we have a clear objective that we are evaluate, able to evaluate e efficacy. We want to make sure that we understand all the resources that are required for the program and evaluate that against the opportunity cost of deploying those folks on something else. We want to make sure that we're not, gonna, that we're not buying things that we can't measure, and we want to be able to measure the things that we do buy. For people, retaining great talent is a lot less expensive than continuously trying to replace it. There are a lot of different places to look if you want to begin to evaluate the efficacy of the security organization.